England have just one thing on their minds, and that is to ensure that that coveted place in the knockout stages is theirs after 90 minutes. They have the luxury of knowing it is in their own hands. Three points would be plenty to see them through. However, anything less than that, and it could become precarious. The look on the faces of the players, nothing but utterly focused. They know what they have to do. A big performance now will count. This, of course, one of the most recognisable venues in the Netherlands, perhaps the whole of the continent. It is the Johan Cruyff Arena. England are a team on a mission. Maximum points, and they're on to bigger and better things. Well, Peter, the, the question that comes to mind is how much do they want it? These players know that this could be the gateway for, for bigger things. Progression, for starters, brings greater financial reward, it increases the brand power and can enhance the whole business side of things. Individual player profile elevation is also a huge incentive. Careers can be catapulted from this, it's worth remembering. We have already started here. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Well, I'm going to go for the little wriggler, that is Raheem Sterling. Uh, his small frame and, and pace gives him a real advantage over bigger, slower defenders. And his turning sharpness is another very tricky part of his game. And he's a handful. Yeah, the easiest way to make a difference is to score, so no argument there. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Kane. Looking for a corner. Rashford. Oh, that's a fine challenge. Well, both sides have actually looked poor going forward. We've hardly seen anything meaningful yet. Jordan Henderson. And it's Sterling. And here's Kane. Kane going for goal! Goal! England! England take the lead! Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. That's the way you go about things if you want to qualify. It's superb. And helps available out wide. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. And here's Sterling. Dyer. Kane. And through to the goalkeeper. Natko. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Hemed, and the counter is on. Maguire. Natko. Victory now would mean so much. Hoists it forward. Good idea, just poorly executed. Could move up a gear here. Sterling tries running with the ball at his feet. Kane shoots! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited, and they need filling, and fast. And that's been lever clear. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Maguire. Chilwell, over to the left. 
Fletcher averted for now. He's a clever pass. Here it comes. And he's there to cut it out. Rashford. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Final action of the first half. So there you have it. A close sport half of football. Still had its moments and ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up to now. Well, that certainly pleased the fans, and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline. The question is now, can they protect it? England, the happier of the teams, heading in for half time, 1 0 up. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. England just about have their noses in front. Natko. And here's Kane. And here's Rashford. And it's Dyer. Rashford. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Strong punch. And it's Stowe. Goes for goal! Defence has got rid of that. How many interceptions have we seen now? Someone's got to up the quality and, and set an example. Has he found his man? And it's played forward. Sterling. And the through ball is intercepted. Looking to hit the front line. Very well to intervene. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. So, Jim, what are you thinking? There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. Ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Deli Alley. And here's Rashford. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? <laughs> Tries a shot! It's there! And with that goal comes comfort! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. England have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. We're looking at a very different game now, the command has been established. Rashford has embarrassed himself a little there, he'll take some stick in the dressing room for that, I can tell you. Drives it towards the front, Maguire gets into the right position to intercept. Jordan Henderson... And here's Kane. Ali, he's had a look. And the finish! It's bounced out! Yes! And the lead is extended still further. 
He was so alert to the possibilities there. Great stuff. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. England have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Yeah, their position is a, a dominant one now, Peter, so introducing one of the youngsters for some added experience is bang on. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. And here's Henderson. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Oh, real danger here. He gets past his man. That's a bad place to challenge. What's he giving? Well, the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Oh, it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line. Very impressive. Henderson brings the ball forward. Now it's Sterling. Sterling, nicely controlled. Forward it goes. Looking to break out here. And it's got through. Just the goalkeeper to beat. Oh, the ball's come loose. Stones floats one over. England making consecutive changes here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who is going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. No, no way through there. Now it's Sterling. Oh, good interception. There's official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. There's a long ball. Chilwell gets well to read it and intercepts. Walker battles to win it back. And that's that. England have booked their berth in the knockout stage. What a prospect for them. A job really well done so far. So another win, that's two from two, and it is looking good.